Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I have a Dollar Tree haul. I thought I was gonna have to cut it into two, but I don't think I need to. Um, we're just gonna get right into it. I love this shirt, it's so soft. I'm gonna wear it as a regular shirt, but then I'm also gonna use it as a pajama shirt. So I just wanted to wear it now. It's really hot today, so it's a perfect day to wear it. So I went ahead, I've seen this sign before and both Dollar Trees that are closest to me, every time they have it, it's like, ruined and there's a piece missing this one's not that bad and it makes it look like it's distressed so it says welcome and it has the bunnies i just noticed this one's missing a tail but i can always just you know glue a cotton ball on there and you wouldn't even notice it so my back door has a wreath but it looks really plain so i'm gonna see if this will fit in the middle of it and if not then i'll just hang this on my back door and i'll just hang my wreath inside but I wanted this one and like I said every time I would see it there's like a chunk missing and it's not like it's something I can fix. So I went ahead and picked this up and then I'm, tr I'm trying to get through all these hauls so I can, it's mainly this one, I need something out of here to do a last minute DIY for Easter and then I'll do my house tour. So just bear with me there will be a house tour. Um, so I went ahead and saw this. A lot of this is from the Dollar Tree over by the Walmart I went to the other day that I was telling you guys. So as I said before, my bestie is keto, not like 100% in keto. She does do keto and I hauled that other keto book for her. Um, I'm glad I didn't send her package out yet because I've been finding some more stuff that I want to send her and I saw this one and it's different. So I'm sure she'll like this one. And then there's four other ones that come with it. And I mean, there's a chocolate peanut butter smoothie, there's soup, there's guacamole, there's egg salad, there's keto bread, chicken meatballs. Like there's just a ton of different stuff in here. So I'm sure she will like this to give her another idea of some stuff for her to make. So I got that for her and I'll send that in her package. Um, Simply Jessica. Hey girl, I finally remembered your name. I saw you haul these and I was like, oh my God, I need those in my life. Well, not really, but I want them in my life. And I immediately put them on my wish list when I saw you haul them and this Dollar Tree had them and I'm so excited. They're the Crayola Take Note Permanent Markers and I got all three that they had. So this one you get like a green and a blue. So you get this light blue and then this like mint green color. So I got that one. This one you get black and like a dark bluish purple color. I wish it would tell you. Oh, it does. All Nighter, which is the blue, and then Always Onyx is the black one. Bravocado is this green one. And Infinite Oasis is the blue. And then this one has wild and free which is the lighter pink and then the beat goes on so i got all three i'm super excited to try these i love gel pens sharpies highlighters markers so excited um i needed another sharpie because i was using a few of them for some diys and i want those specifically to stay with my crafting stuff for diys and then this one i'll use for when i send out packages so this one i'll keep with all like my tape my packaging tape, my labels, all that stuff. So that's why I went ahead and got another one because the other two are really dull and like they still work, but it's, you know what I mean? The fine tip is what you need to write on a package. So I picked up another Sharpie. Um, I saw Simply Jessica. <laughs> I saw you haul this lip gloss and I wanted this one. Um, this is the one that's called Dancer and it's like a light nudish color and I can't wait to try this. Um, I have an Apple Watch. It doesn't have a tempered per screen over it. It doesn't have a protector. It just has the wristband and that's it. So I've seen these before and I never picked them up because I didn't have a watch. Now I have a watch. So I don't know if these are gonna fit and if these are even gonna work. But hey, for a dollar, you can't beat that. It says fits Apple Watch. So I got one in black and it's just like a bumper. Um, it's just a case that goes around the actual watch itself. So I got the black one and then I went ahead and got the rose gold pink one. 
So I'm going to give those a try. I'll let you guys know if those work because I know a few of you have smart or Apple watches in case you're wondering. And like I said, it's a dollar and if it works, it works. So I've seen this on Instagram. They also had, they also have headphones and they have a ring holder for the back of your phone. Now this Dollar Tree didn't have, so I'll just show you. I don't have anything that this can charge, but I had to get it anyways because it has the watermelon. Um, I sold my tablet, so I obviously don't have a tablet anymore. My phone is an Apple watch, or Apple, my watch is Apple, my headphones, I have AirPods. I don't have anything that takes this, but my husband's phone does, and I just, I had to get it. I know, it's stupid. You don't have anything to charge it with, but it, I'll find something to charge it with, and it has the watermelon. So they have matching headphones. This store didn't have them. They only had the pineapples. And they didn't have any of their new ring holders, but there's a watermelon ring holder and I really, really want it. So if anybody sees that, I will pay you for it. Like, let me know if you find it because I absolutely want the ring holder um, that you put on the back of your phone. But I went ahead and picked this up anyways. Like I said, it's really cute and it has a watermelon on it. Um, I picked up a glue because I thought I had one for those nails for that giveaway. I guess I don't have glue. I thought I did. I might have given it away um, to one of my sisters. Or I might have used it. So I got a brand new one. It'll go with those um, mauve purplish gray nails I hauled with the flowers. This will go with that. So I'll include glue for you guys. That way you don't have to go out and buy it because I know some people can't find this brand and I love this one. I love the pink one but they didn't have it. But this is just as good too. So I'll include that with that and I'll let you know when I do that giveaway. I've seen these on Instagram. These were on my wish list. I have my earrings in a in a jewelry box that's a heart, it's rose gold, and my daughters are in there and I wanna keep all her earrings and jewelry separate. So I picked up this little heart and it's pale rose and I will put all her earrings in here. That way it'll go in her bathroom. She knows these are her earrings and we won't have to dump my thing out every single time she wants to change her earrings. So I got this for her. It doesn't really close that well, but like I said, it's mainly just for decor on her bathroom counter and then it's gonna have her earrings in it. So I got that for her. They also had white and baby blue. So I got her the pale rose pink. I'm doing a DIY. I mentioned in my Walmart haul, I hauled those knobs. Um, I'm pretty sure you're gonna be able to guess what I'm making if you follow a certain group on Instagram and Facebook. If not, then you won't know. I'm not filming, sorry, I don't film my DIYs. I know you guys really like watching them. I might show, post a picture of it once it's done, since I can do it on my community tab, but I'm not filming. Um, Cause I've never done this, so I don't even know how well it's gonna turn out. So you need a basket, and it's just the all white basket. I'm gonna use this wine glass. I picked up this one and then the stove covers. Um, I think you only need the little one, but I'm not sure. So I'm excited to do this DIY. It'll give me something to do. It's been sitting over there and I've been waiting for that knob. So I haven't had a chance to do it because I needed that knob. So I got that. This is also the other thing I needed. I know you guys are like, really, you needed a frame. I hauled a black one from Dollar Tree and I really don't like it for my Easter DIY. I will save the frame and I will use it for another photo that I have, but I love this one with the wood grain. So I'm gonna swap it out and then I'll be able to do my house tour. So I needed this to do my DIY. It's just a five by seven. Um, this is the Dollar Tree that has the bigger section of Crafter Square stuff. They don't have a whole aisle, but they have a bigger section than my actual two Dollar Trees that are closer to me. Um, I went ahead and picked up one of these little boxes and I have an idea of something that I want to store in here, um, but I am going to paint it. And if it doesn't work out, then I'll just find something to do with this. I'm not sure, but I picked up one. And then if the welcome bunny sign doesn't fit on that wreath that I have on my back door already, I'm going to paint this and see if this will fit. And it just says hello. It's a wooden little cutout and you can paint it any color you want. Um, 
I found these stencils and I don't have this one, so I went ahead and picked it up. You just get one sheet, but it has the letters of the alphabet on it, so I picked that up. And then my daughter wanted another coloring book. She's been into coloring lately, so she picked up this one with the uh, Paw Patrol. So I'll let her color that in here. I picked up one more Easter card. Um, I went and picked up stamps today. I dropped off more Easter cards, but the one I have, I really don't want to use that for somebody that I, that I forgot to send one to that has already sent me one and I feel really bad. I didn't like what it said for her. So I just picked up this one. I thought it was really cute. These ones are a dollar because they come in the little plastic, but it has these really cute bunnies on it. And then I'll be able to decorate inside. And then it comes with a... Sorry, my daughter was chasing my son and he was screaming. So I picked up an Easter card. I'm gonna send this out to her. I'm gonna do it tonight and I'll just put it in my mailbox. Another card. I finally found the one in a melon journal and I think my bestie picked up one for me, which is totally fine because I wanna put one in my purse and then I wanna keep one on my nightstand by my bed. Cause in the middle of the night, sometimes things come to mind and I need to write it down. So if she did, if she did pick up one for me and send it to me, then that's fine. And if not, that's okay too. But it has the little Velcro and it was the only one. They had no other designs. I've seen the guacamole one. I've seen, there's a pizza one, but this was the only one there. And this is the one I wanted. And then I think she also picked up these for me. And if she did, that's fine. I'm gonna save these for a future giveaway. Um, and if she didn't, then I got them. But I'm pretty sure she picked them up for me. It says you're one in a melon. And then it has 60 sheets and it has two different notepads. So these aren't connected. This is a smaller one. And then you have the list pad. And if she did get them for me, I am gonna glue a magnet on the back and I'm gonna put that on my fridge. I think that's really dumb that they didn't put one on there. I don't ever like to keep list pads down on my table. I like to put them on my fridge. And then I picked up this cherry one for friend mail or a giveaway. Same thing, two different sets of list pads and they're 60 sheets. Shannon saw this pen and it has eight different colors and it has trolls from this, the world tour, the second movie. And here's all the colors. So I'll let her color with this. I saw these new wall decals for her room. She's starting to get into moat ponies and they have My Little Pony. So you get all the characters. And here's what they look like. So I got that to add to her room. She picked up these two ponies. She wanted both. They come with little brushes. So she'll have two little ponies to play together and half the time her brother wants what she has so I have to get two of everything now. So those, this Dollar Tree the other night when I went to get the stuff for my DIY, I was able to find juice. I got two more, they had a whole bunch on the shelf. Such a great deal. My husband already drank through one of them. 40% more and it's the bonus size and it's 56 fluid ounces. So I picked up two more, I'll put those in the fridge. The hubby has been loving the Sunny D. I picked up one more of the Happy Easter plates, 18. I've been using these for lunch for me and my daughter and she loves it. She gets all excited because of the eggs and I wanna have enough to last until Easter because I've been do using them every day. So I picked up one more. I still have plenty of napkins though. Um, I got one soap because I'm almost running out of my soap from Grove. I guess I ordered more hand soap than I did dish soap. So I wanna have enough dish soap. And this one had this one, and it's the Ajax with charcoal and citrus. Oh, that smells really good. So I'll have this as backup once I use all my Grove soap. I have like half of one and then one full one, and that's all I have. I have way too many sprays and way too many hand soaps. So once I order again from them, I'll order some more dish soap, but I wanted to have this in case I run out and people have been buying soap like crazy so i just grabbed it when i saw it i kind of went puzzle crazy so just bear with me there's going to be like six of them and um i've been doing like one a day it's been really helpful with my stress and it's making the day go by faster it helps it it's just really calming and i love it so i went ahead and picked up this one it's 300 and there's cats in a little basket i just thought it was so cute this one's gonna be hard so I picked up that one. I picked up this one with the coffee cups. I want to frame this one and put it over by my coffee bar. Also 300. 
This one's 300 and it has balloons. This one's gonna be really hard too. That cupcake one was hard. If you saw me post it on Instagram. My daughter saw this one and this one I might frame and put in their bathroom. And it has a dolphin with the ship and like the treasure chest and it's just really nautical underwater. And then this one has 500 and it has birds. So I picked up that one. And then Shannon wanted this one. This one will probably be easy because there's only a hundred. And I might frame this one and see if I can fit it in a frame and give it to my sister-in-law. But it has two little cats in a box with apples. They're just so cute. So those are all the puzzles. I haven't been able to find any at my Dollar Trees. I kind of wiped them clean and these were different. I'm on the hunt for the Disney one. It has all the princesses on it. I saw it on Instagram. I cannot find any of those new Disney ones and Walmart had no puzzles. Um, this Dollar Tree had the Paw Patrol graham crackers. I like putting these in my diaper bag for when I'm on the go. If the kids get hungry, I have a snack for them. So these are perfect for that because they're little bags. So I got two more boxes because I still have the Teddy Grahams. They'll eat those during the day, but I like putting these in my diaper bag, like I said, for when I'm out and about. I'll have a snack in case they need it. So I got two boxes. Almost done here. Last food thing, I hauled these before. My husband said they were okay, but he said they were good. They were just not his favorite. And they've been out of certain candies that we like. So I just picked up another bag of the Laffy Taffy Bites. I got one more box of the Tumbling Tower. I have some, but I don't have this one in the solid brown, like wood. I have the one with the dark pieces and the dark pieces are really hard to hot glue together. Like they don't stay. And I might, I have another DIY in mine, so I'm gonna need more anyways. So I picked up another box and you get 36 in here. I'm doing, this will be a future DIY, not right now, but I picked up the dice while they still have them. So I need six of them. And I just noticed this one's ruined, so I need to take that off. But I'm gonna be painting them anyways, so that's okay. I got all the same color, just so that way it's easier. Um, and that'll be a future DIY later down the road. Last thing I got from Dollar Tree was down in the food aisle, and it was the last one, and it was the clear storage bin. I have one full of washi tape, and I need this one for some more organization in my closet with like cards and friend mail and stuff. So that's why I picked this up. It was the last one and I love these. So that's it for this video, you guys. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. I'd love for you to be part of my YouTube family if you're not already. And until then, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.